Welcome back, boys. So today we have the third and final part of my SPA 21-22 hockey series. I say final part for now. Maybe perhaps in the future I'll open a box again. I do not know. I will say I did appreciate my time with this product. This is really a product that I've loved opening and... I cannot wait to open more of it in the future, whether it be 21, 22 or 22, 23 or whatever. How many years I open hockey cards and hockey boxes? Probably for a long time. If you haven't seen part one and part two of this series, click here to check them out now or check them out after whatever you want. But let's not waste any more time and just get right into it. Let's go! I hope that we get a big rookie in this box, hopefully a Caulfield or maybe like just a patch. So far, I think as you can see in the background, we've been hitting pretty decent, but I will never say no to being greedy. So here we go. First pack. I believe all these boxes came from the same case, so I don't think we've had a case hit or anything like that. Anything of the sort. So that's still in the cards. So here we go. Chesterkin, Patrick Liney, Pavelski, Fiala, Ryan O'Reilly. Matt Barzal and oh, 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 oh wow that's a big one retro oh it's a little bit smudged that's too bad but wow retro future watch Quinton Byfield and a Swayman pageantry wow and a green Byfield or is that green no that's just normal holy okay that starts off the opening quite well jesus i don't know what the value of this is but out of 99 that's a huge card retro future watch that's awesome i quite especially like the little foiling on the future watch here as you can see but wow that is fucking cool let's put him right here over jack hughes wow i am not kidding when i say that the first box was good but the second and third are just awesome jesus out of 99 that's awesome it's a little bit of a shame that the the autograph is smudged but hey i feel like at this point i'll take anything right it adds some character it means he really did sign it so here we go we got a future oh sorry future watch limited of cole schwind schwedeint a page entry of wayne gretzky okay that's nice and a top rookies of robin salo always love pulling a wayne gretzky card the goat the goat let's get into the next pack here we go John Carlson, Dreisaitl, Pasternak, Kulvanen, Tyler Toffoli. Oh, Nikita Kucherov. And we have a Signs of the Time already. Okay. So let's see. We got Alexander Holtz here in the back. Page entry of Anders Lee. And let's see who this is. Hopefully it's someone good. No. Is this Kit? No, this is Jake Allen, right? Yeah, Jake Allen. Woo! I thought it was going to be Carey Price, but no, I recognize that helmet. Signs of the time, Jake Allen. That's really cool. As a Habs fan, you know, I'm not going to complain about getting an autographed Habs card. Truly my my first... Whoops. Literally dropped it. My first big Habs card, I think. Or at least that I've opened. Put him here. Okay, well, two packs in, two autographs. Hopefully it keeps going. Who knows? Maybe there's an error and they're just going to give us eight autographs. <laughs> or is it 10 packs? Yeah, it's 10 packs. 10 autographs. These cards do not want to come out. Bobrovsky. Darlene, Kikrin, The Brinkett, Jacob Vrana, Nico Heeshear, and then Limited Red of Jordan Eberle, Seth Jarvis here on the pageantry rookie, and a true leaders of Patrice Bergeron. I don't know why I said that with an accent, as if I couldn't say it in French normally, but hey, that's uh, that's the YouTube persona, baby. Kerry Price, Seth Jones, Brock Besser, Max Pacioretty, Cal Pedersen, UC Saros, here we have Sean Dursey on the limited future watch. Oh, Cole Caulfield. Page entry. Very nice. Habs heavy box. And we have a Nils, Nils Lungsvis. Okay, I'm honestly not sure if you can get more than two autos. So maybe this box blew its load too early, but we'll see. Maybe we can still get something cool. So here we go. Nugent Hopkins. Panarin. Josh Bailey. Victor Olofsson. Nicholas Backstrom. Jordan Binnington. Kevin Fiala. Stupid sexy Fiala. Feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. <laughs> Stupid sexy Flanders. Spectrum FX. Oh, tier two. Okay. Benoit Olivier Groux. I've never heard of this guy. And a wow. Cole Caulfield on the die cut. Pretty cool. Getting so far a lot of hits that I'm liking. So that's always nice. Finish it off strong here. Sebastian Ajo. Braden Point. Jack Hughes. Troy Terry. Connor Garland. Dougie Hamilton. Here we have a oh, 
Limited future watch of Alex Turcotte. Nice. Oh, future icons out of 399 of Wyatt Kalinyuk and Philip Kurashev. And a blue... True. Oh, that's really nice, actually. Wow. Blue true leaders of Jamie Ben. I think this is one in 120 packs, I believe. I don't know. But uh, yeah, future icons. Pretty nice. Three packs left. Let's see what the hockey gods bring us. Hooby Dooby Doo. Markstrom. Atkinson. Matthew Kachuk. Nikolai Ehlers. Elias Pedersen. Here we have a limited red of Cam Talbot. A pageantry rookie of Spencer Knight. And a top rookies of Trevor Zegers. Nice. I don't know why his face looks so weird here. His nose is like caved in. I don't know if you can see that. Pretty funny. Next pack. I don't think we're going to get a patch auto. But you never know. Jimmy Stu here in the front. The Rock Johnson. Nylander. Nick Big Nick. I'm just going to leave it at that. Austin Matthew. Tyler Bertuzzi. Brandon Duhame on the limited red future watch. Spoil it a little bit, but we have Alexander Barkov here. And on the Spectrum FX, we have Kyle Connor. Kyle Connor, natural born shooter, except when he doesn't shoot. And here we go in the last pack. Let's hope for some last pack magic. Got Jay Gensel, Miro Heiskinen, Claude Giroux, Jordan Eberly, Cam Talbot, Kale McCarr. Oh, oh. And. Okay. McCarr into McCarr. <laughs> Here we have a pageantry of David Pasternak. Okay, we got eight, 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 and then 32. Wait, oh wait, no. Four times eight is, wait, that is 32. That's crazy. Well, there you have it, guys. All the hits from the box. Honestly, truly nothing too, too crazy, but I will say in this three-part series, these three boxes, I can't complain. I got, I think, I don't know if I got my money back necessarily, but... I definitely got my, mon my money back in terms of having fun. Can I say that? Is that a thing? Just this card, really nice. But yeah, like, this was a super fun rip. I got some huge rookies, to be honest. Like, nothing like a Cole Caulfield or Zegris or Raymond or anything. But, you know, just this out of 99, that's that's actually insane. I, I can't believe I hit that. And the Jake Allen. This one will stay in the collection. I love Jake the Snake. Really good goaltender. And, of course, we got... The Spencer Knight in the other video is a little bit of a spoiler, but I guess this is part three. So go watch part two anyways. But yeah, that's going to be it for today. Stay tuned for some more content, some more boxes coming out. Uh, I would like to do maybe like a little summer recap in terms of what rookies to buy, what cards to be on the lookout for for the following months. I know the hobby kind of takes a little bit of a downtick when the season is over and with reason. But you should know that that's the best season to buy because that's when prices are at their lowest. So make sure you're subscribe make sure you like and you comment help me with the algorithm help me make more content that you like and uh honestly just thank you i have thirty thousand dollars in credit card debt when they call i tell them i can't pay it back yet